And we're back. Ah, another episode beginning in darkness. Day 19. Uh, remember what I said about like, oh, in the last episode, well, yeah, I definitely uh, play in smaller bursts now that I've played a lot of the game or whatever. Apparently when I'm recording, uh, that's not the case because last recorded episode was an hour. Oh, I remember where I am. So this time I have set a timer, try and um, not uh, overdo things because my, oh, there's something, there was something wrong with my video upload size. I think I messed up some setting in my recorder. Uh, so I've tweaked some things and hopefully we won't be producing a one hour video that is three gigabytes. Luckily, YouTube does not care how large a video you upload is, for some reason. Alright, uh, yes, alright, oh, I was in the little house just near um, home. That's where we were. And it is daytime. We still seem to need this light to see. or as much of the rabbit bits as we can. Take more stuff with us. Oh, no, no. Shove that down. Make sure there's nothing going on, it's a wrong character, okay. okay. Now it's really just a question of, oh, how much? I guess we have all of this stuff like this. Oh, I never finished harvesting this. Luckily it's daytime, even though it looks like absolute darkness inside, so I can do that. So there we go. Yeah, it doesn't even show the thing that I want to eat, which is nuts. The less we smell like meat, the better. Uh, before I go out, do a little staring at the back end here, make sure it's not on fire. Okay. Looks like it's running. Torch. Okay. Scoop up all this coal. No, not that. Yep. It puts us over where we were before. So now we loot from both these houses. Jammed in our pockets. How bad is it? Oh, it's pretty bad. So we're gonna try and walk all this home. Basically, if I encounter kind of predator, we're gonna have to fight. Cut them down, etc. All of those loaded, loaded. Okay. Um, while we're here, I know I picked them up. Future rabbit hunting, but every shred of bait counts for now. So this, the encumbrance meter is actually just a giant sliding scale. Um, you may notice when you're like 0.10 over, you don't actually feel much of a penalty, but when you're super duper over like this, a whole 15 kilos, uh, you get real slow. Well, by the time we're home, home, we're gonna be real tired. So from this point, Point. I have about a half hour before I need to call it quits. Thanks. 
We're just gonna do a lot of walking on this highway. Oh yeah, and somewhere along this stretch of road, unless it despawned, should be deer hide that I dropped for myself, which we will, of course, try and pick up. Came actually from a deer that was power that live one is now. Any further, maybe it despawned. Sure, if one of those splotches up ahead is it entirely closer. So there's something dead on that little hill too. Definitely need to come back over here with the rifle. Say hello to those whatever cutesy name we're giving the deer. Yep, there's the deer belt. And be heavy. Real slow. That. Oh, let's follow my old torches. We're not gonna deal with that right now. We're not good on extra carry space. Once we get this coal back, uh, it's either stay at home, fill with things, or go and hunt items in a new region or start traveling to a new region we're probably not going to get too far in this segment especially at this speed uh, st uh, game update is supposed to add something called a trova trois i'm not sure of the pronunciation pronunci pronunciation of that um, but it's basically a uh, type of primitive hand cart, which I believe just involves two crossed sticks uh, tied off center. So you hold the ones that are closer to the tie behind you with your hands and then across the triangle shape formed by the other two, you drape a cloth or something. And then you can lay stuff in that and pull it kind of pull in a sled, the ends will drag, and hopefully you can like lug more stuff around. All about lugging stuff around. I see him heading my way. If we drop the meat, see how he jiggle jig jig jiggered to the side there? He wants this. Pick it up. He immediately aggroves, drop it, he stops. Doesn't matter how little we carry, now we eat it. Hopefully he remains de -aggroed. Having him on me wouldn't be bad. I'd rather be having him behind me so I don't even have to spend a match on the torch. Uh, it looks like the wolves have respawned on the lake. Which is fine by me. think we're anywhere near cooking file four. No, not even before five yet. Time before they're a food source. We'll get there. I have a fishing manual pocket. Yeah, to read. stand out there. If they've spawned back in, maybe the bear has too. 
That's another thing I could do instead of going for the deer is I could go hunt the bear. There's one bear left on the map even if the others are still down from an in-game week ago. Um, can't eat the bear because it may make you sick. Again, unless you're cooking level 5. Um, but the bear hides are particularly valuable for clothes and better on things. So, very handy to have. Just down there, I think that's our signage for our turn off to home. Despite being here for most of this playthrough, oh yeah, we're there, we're there. That house is uh, close by, I know we are. Still learning this map. Again, don't know where that one connected to Pleasant Valley is, so I still don't have it all figured out. But, we're almost home with some time to spare. I'll be able to do something other than just drop off these resources. Mm -hmm. The rock. Is that a strange patchy? Oh, that's just a bit of terrain. Okay. That'll throw you off. Thought that was a goodie for me. Ooh. Such luck. Yeah, there's some houses around. Uh, I've been through them all already for their items. I'll eventually need to scoop through them again to uh, tear up all the curtains and things. All that tucked into the house, the base. Maybe that could be our project, although that's a pretty boring project. It would kill time and keep me close to home. But, meh. I think my clothes are in pretty mm, see the tracks. On the other side of the hill. Oh, yeah, they respawned here too. Yep, there's one across the way and one on the right. Yep, on the right, see him. Now. Two on the four. Alright. Can I get him out here to the flat? So. No attacking yet, now he's a damn. Oh, that shot looked like it was dead on, but I guess I missed. Before they re aggro, we're just gonna try and go inside. I was hopeful that he would bleed, so you know, one of these little pests would be definitively dead, but it seems we have our combat cut out for us this morning. So, what I would. Uh, no, all that, all that stuff I was thinking of doing, well, we may just have to put clean up here at home. Be able to open up the uh, fishing spot and stuff again. Do I? I do want this fire so I can turn around and go right back out and fight those wolves. In here. Here. Up the rabbit pellets. Step over the little drop of the deer hide. There we go. Stuff. I put down is going to help me not be burdened. Um. Go to the straw. Then tons of coal. That much. Off our two pieces of reading material. Based on the beds so that I remember there for oh, I had some ground now. There for reading. Up there. Three light. Uh, ton of this stuff. I'm just going to sort here. Why am I so heavy? That's got me. Sticks, water. Oh, I've carried those work jeans all the way home. 
That was not my intent. Oh, and the thermals. Yep, we're just gonna have an ugly little pile of wheat to sort later. Okay. There's some space created, and we can go ahead. Or you just gobbling up. Uh, hmm. Are we gonna run right off to a new region? I would not shoot these wolves, right? Because they might respawn by the time I'm back, but... So we're kind of... By choosing to spend the ammo on them, we're making a choice. Uh, and that choice is violence. Unless they're just gone. It's cool too. In which case I choose to go fishing. Like, heck. Oh, nope, they're here. Just a matter of where. Oh, I can move so fast now. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, there he is. Again, we let him come out to the flat. Can even test to see if reloading the revolver tells us anything. Oh, he's, he's uh, I, I clicked to fire and it just didn't. Um, so that was an experience that I just had. I have 20 sticks, which is definitely enough to go fishing. Just like before, to flag around. Kind of just need to get a fire lit in order to uh, some torches. Jesus Christ! So if if wolves didn't respect the torch, gonna just fucking run off. I didn't even aim at you. What are you afraid of? Okay, we need to drop the torch. To light this other torch, because... Yeah, we may just need to go back inside and start that fire. This is our last torch. Which to ward off and attack. I thought he was behind me, but he's not moving very swiftly. While we're out here, we'll use this torch. Up, together, up. All together, one stick, I guess. Oh, he's, he's on me. She's not appearing. Where the heck is he? Okay, we're back on the flat again, hey buddy. Out of resources to play. Uh -huh. And that's a hit. Nice. So... Yeah. Debating on like trying to stay outside to make sure he doesn't despawn, but... Or stop bleeding randomly. Okay, we should take this fire in. Check our hides cured. Okay, one hide cured, two, one more to go there. Cured, cured, cured. Oh, oh, okay, that's good. We have our hides cured, so I actually make a cool new coat. Just gonna get rid of this book. I'm tired of carrying the weight. are stored up. Uh, less useful oh, yeah. resource bits. Oh no, put that down. Uh, three yeah. on the ground. Bam. I guess I just have another book. Keep in spot. Let's get this going. So today is definitely an inside kind of day. I don't have a corner here where all the clothing and junk goes, basically. Oh, 
don't worry about how I possibly sleep in this bed without these objects in the room. It's fine. Basically, our goal, we are going to that up. Go ahead. Oh, I'm not of that. Those menus are just, uh, oh, okay. That's how we're going to be. Once they're open, I've already cooked, probably. So we'll just put those down and look for, yeah, not these. And our whole goal here basically being to accrue uh, cooking EXP. Repetition. One becomes an expert cook, you know, by just opening every can you own and cooking the contents. It's totally how it works. I had been meaning to get around to doing, but that's some time. So yes, this is, this is how we store food. It's totally fine. Don't worry about it. Um, yeah, those are gonna warm. The other thing, though, is I have enough stuff around to consider a double of all this for us. Got two, three, four, and two, three, four. And four. Next thing. Yeah, this is not going to be an exciting video. This is uh, purely skill grinding, crafting, preparing for our next whatever we do. Weight management. And yeah, put it on the edge. I thought it turned green there for me. Ah! Totally balanced. Hydraulic management. I know I have. Uh, yep. Yeah. And four. So I did need fresh torches. It's not a very good torch. We'll just test that. Looking for ones that are like one third. Oh, yeah, I think that one. What's well, not finished? Shh. Oh, no, rage. Because it wasn't finished. Does not count. It's experience points. Goes down for now. I had killed all the wolves, I would do this outside, but this is life. So hopefully they would still be dead when I got home. Oh, they're back. Unfortunately. Oh, oh there's a good one. Yeah, and used torches. Convert back to the sticks. Feed back into the system. Okay, that one's good. There's a cooking XP tick. Oh, I suppose I could actually just right click on them. 
they would plop down to where they need to go, but... Oops. Got a lot of seen them as I've been flashing this menu over and over. A lot of uh, this stuff. Well, not a lot, but some. Or as uh, travel snacks to their weight. We need to go pile there for now. To dealing with the sorting those later. Why are, why are we rigorously breaking these down back in sticks? Well, just, if you don't, they never go away. And, uh, stick, I can just feed back in the fire and it'll be out of my... Passes two minutes of time, which is good time. And mass cooking like this. The XP marker still appears, so we'll go. Just keep doing like that until all these are done. Until my can opener explodes for overuse, one of the two. Yeah. Minutes on barrel. Um. Can I start on the code? Spend a half hour at minimum to start the code. So yeah, now that I have those, um, Now that I have those pelts cured, uh, that does give me a reason to stay home, which is to do that crafting. It may, it may, it may not be a good idea actually to cook all the food like this. as quickly as possible, then this will be a non-issue. And I can always go out and fish. Like, I still have to eat all of this. There's a lot there. But this is all the food on this map, and from Desolation Point for the most part. I do still have many pancakes to make. So that'll also keep me... busy. Done doing this cooking. Again, we're just doing these little crafting things in between just to fast forward time, basically. Um, go do that. No, don't eat. Look. There we go. Yeah, and that finishes the cooking backlog other than tea. Have tea stuff floating around in tons of water, which to make it. So that's probably what we'll do next. Like these things here that I've been processing are actually tea ingredients. Yes, I'm sure it smells very aromatic in here with all this. Hot soup. Oh, that's gonna keep heating up if I leave it there, huh? Until it burns like that. Damn it. I forgot that was organic, so we've lost a few calories. Although, so strangely, most of them didn't do that. That's weird. So, we want to drop down these. Cook and start cooking. Because we may need to throw more onto the fire or we're running out of laboratory uh, things we can do. That's a thing. Okay, 
now. Let's got rid of the menu options because we're out of water. You actually need some of them green teas. Kind of wanted fire hardened arrows just to uh, have them. Oh, 22 minutes. That's that's not gonna do. I'll do it for me. Game. I guess we're just gonna cook and fast forward. That's how you're gonna be. Um, and now we're down to cooking in. Do I have two more? Okay. Stacking games is not very good. That's okay. Once I bring it home, there won't be any more on this map for some time. I could all just I could just throw it in a drawer, but that feels even weirder than generating these cups out of my inventory for no reason. There we go. Resolves that. Eleven minutes left. Um, water supplies, okay. We are going to... If I wanted to have them made, we'll just go ahead and make... those arrows. Oh, and we are... kind of running out of time. Kind of. Okay, we have those. Now oh, I have a rifle belt. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Let's see if we can just load, yeah, we can just load these into a rifle. It's fine by me. There we go. It's an arrow shaft. I'm making an arrow. Oh. My scroll wheel is not scrolling. Oh, click. I guess that's actually super light. But for now, we want to check the in game time. Started on crafting the coat. <sighs> right. Some things. I'll oh, just me some hands and I can try up. Stay indoors too long in this game, you will get uh, cabin fever. It's bad. So I 
are going to mitigate that. Oh, and let's take our book. Just in case there's a wolf right by the door. Slip out to whatever weapon this is. Oh, a blizzard convenient. Interestingly, I am still warm. It's going to keep getting colder all the way to day 50. So, eventually blizzards will be a threat again, but we are going to read a book until character gets tired, and then that'll signal kind of the end of our episode here. And mainly just read in one hour instances, watch the meters, watch the time. Ooh, and calm me down. There you go, just enjoy. Snow. The dim sounds. It's so right in the car camp. Gonna slow it down even more. Poof, it's gone. Replaced by. What time? Alright. Slip back in. Darkness. Drink the remainder of that soup. Probably should have made some pancakes and not be eating all the soup. So you can warm up with the soup when you're cold. So it's kind of tactical to uh, not chow down on it like a barbarian. You can eat some of the stuff instead. Uh, we'll, we'll figure out particulars later. Oh, there's a. You see there, why are they on the ground? I reload indoors. Something. That's a little glitchy. Just a smidge. Should we have our two, two L of water on us? A smidge of bar. Oh, and the other bar goes down a smidge. Ah, that'll be fun. Extinguish that. Down until we hit the bed. That's a day. Not very exciting visually. We do with some wolves. We hauled all that corn. Uh, started the wolf coat. I need to write down in my notes to finish that. And where did we end? Day 20. Mm -hmm. And another third of the cooking bar. Of course, that's. We're not going to be able to go nearly that fast again because I won't have. Uh, I guess I have all those pancakes, but those. Kind of go bad fast once you make them. Check. Oh, yeah, sewing. Bad. Yeah. I got chomped by a wolf on the way to Desolation Point uh, around day 15, so. so these are a little. Ooh, it's like bright. Oh, it's daytime. Wow. Character slept good. Nice. Okay. So we'll revisit all that next time. Or we'll do some of that next time. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed. Until then, bye bye for now.